You know, when I was younger and I got caught into the trap of pornography, I didn't realize quite, I didn't quite understand that, you know, sex between a man and a woman is is a gift from God. You know, a, a man and a woman, that's, that's a special gift. You know, I, I wish I would have known that when I was younger. I wish I would have known that, you know, what happens with porn is it's basically the abuse. It's basically the abuse of a beautiful gift from God. And, you know, the problem with porn is it's basically abusing that gift. And the truth is, is when you're watching porn... What it does to your brain is it basically hijacks your arousal mechanism. And what I mean by that is, you know, I'm, I'm always trying to figure out, I'm always trying to figure out like a really good way to explain this to guys so that they really want to get off of it, you know, and the truth is, is it's like you're taking your brain and you're putting like a, like a silencer on it. You're putting a, you're dulling down your arousal system with real women. And the danger of that, you know, I came across this good article the other day and it just said, the, the problem with that is the biological response with pornography you're you're supposed to have a strong biological response when your girlfriend or your wife takes her clothes off and you're extremely stimulated okay so what happens is as long as you are feeding your mind that pornography it lessens the bond bec because it lessens the biological response that you have with your with your woman so you can imagine you're basically putting your relationship you're basically putting your relationship in jeopardy because you're not going to bond and attach to your girlfriend in in the same way i remember you know i remember when i had a girlfriend and i had you know i had a stack of vhs tapes on my on my vcr and you know i could have been so much Our sex life could have been so much more. Hold on, I got a I got a 1980 Kapala going by. I don't know I don't know what kind of car that was. Nice nice 1980. That they don't build them like that anymore. Anyway, our relationship, our 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 connection could have been even better if if I if I didn't have this force pulling me if I didn't have this force that was dulling the connection between us we would have had a stronger relationship I gar I can absolutely guarantee you that but when you're when you're dulling down your body and your when you're dulling down your body and your brain's response to sex, you're basically preventing your body from attaching to your girlfriend in the same way. That's what's scary about porn. That's what a lot of guys don't understand about porn. And, you know, one of the reasons why erectile dysfunction is so prevalent in today's men is because you're basically you're basically taking your brain 
you're basically taking your brain and you're you're just hijacking that arousal mechanism and then so you you know you go to get with a real woman you go to get with a real woman and you're not going to have the same strong response that you would your your brain isn't going to have the same shock in a good way you know so i just want to encourage you to do whatever you need to do listen a lot of times when when you're into porn a lot of times it's a coping mechanism for pain you have pain that came from somewhere or something or someone maybe you know a lot of times women can man w women can can mess you up a little bit yeah I, I know i know that i know that for a fact what i encourage you to do is you know do what do do whatever you can to address those do it find the source of your pain and do whatever you need to do go see a counselor write it down you know talk to your parents maybe talk to the person who who you have a, you know who did the harm to you do whatever you can and, and face it i promise you that when you are using porn when you are using porn as a coping mechanism you're just avoiding facing the pain head on and moving forward in your life. And you can be so much, guys, listen, I, I promise you.